Hi guys, I thought I'd do a quick review of my new Ridge Rider 200 watt solar panel. Sorry, solar blanket. It's what comes in the bag. You have a five meter extension cable. It's pretty decent thick wires and good quality amps and plugs. You also get some alligator clips and other Anderson plugs so you can plug it in directly to your battery. You also get the MPPT solar controller but I've actually mounted mine in the car so I'll insert a picture in the video. And just some basic instructions. Quality of the bag's pretty decent. Right, there's the little folded up panel. Again, good quality Anderson plugs. the panels all folded out as you can see it all looks decent quality the finish is smooth so you just got to be careful we don't get sand and stuff on them um, otherwise yeah when you fold it back up it can scratch the surface it doesn't appear to be too many blemishes or anything which is nice some of the cheaper ones like the king's ones often come with the with some some you know pre-existing damage which isn't awesome so yeah hopefully they'll go okay it's around 359 dollars from super cheap auto so you know about 150 dollars dearer than the kings but i reckon it's just that little bit better quality so yeah we'll have to do another review once i've used it and we'll see how it all goes cheers it's a little bit difficult to see but here's my solar regulator um, mounted in my 150 prado um as you can see, my brother built a custom bracket, so it attaches to the front, uh, the rail and the battery tray. And if you have a look down here, that's where the, the controller is sitting. And it's just got an Anderson here that's then running direct to the, the battery here um, for the charge component. And then at the front of the car, got another Anderson mounted on a custom bracket. And that's where the solar blanket will plug in. And this is everything plugged in. Um, as you can see, that front panel is in partial shade, but still getting an awesome output. Um, I don't have a, a watt meter or anything like that, but I can see from my um, battery voltmeter that it's jumped up considerably. Um, so yeah, I can imagine it should charge reasonably quickly. That's it all plugged in. This is what my dual battery system is actually powering, just the 40 litre angle fridge. Um, and also at the back of the car, I've got another Anderson plug and that powers camp lights um, that are directly attached to a camper as well as stuff like, you know, USB chargers for iPads and that sort of thing. So yeah, hopefully the, the solar um, blanket will just be an extra way we can keep everything topped up when we're out off grid for a few days.